Hey guys, Chris and Stuff coming at you, full-time thriving adventures. We're here at the Tampa Airstream, and we're going to take a look at a couple of uh, two airstreams, I guess, right. the Caravel Caravelle and the, the Bambi. Bambi. So the first one we're looking at is the Caravel. It's 16, 16 feet. feet, and the next one we'll look at is the Bambi, which is 20, 20 feet. feet. Yep. So here we go. We'll take you through and see what we come up with, yeah. and uh, they look really nice. So they do. let's take a look. Okay. You've arrived at your destination. All right, guys, so here we are at the 16-footer, and it's the Caravel. Kind of pan out, Chris. Show them how cute, tiny it is, right? It's cutie patootie, right? So very good quality Airstream, right? So you've got the awning right there. It's a hand pull out, it looks like. Come around here to the rear. You've got camera. You've got, which is, this is really neat, you can pull it out and then it'll retract too, kind of gives you the shade in here. It's got some storage in here and in here. And then if you come around here, it looks like it's got uh, on demand, which is really great. Yeah. And then uh, it's got the, the water and the flush. And uh, then you come around the front, it's got another, another awning right there, which is nice. And then you've got the real pretty windows. This is kind of neat, Chris. It's got the uh, automatic, uh, what do you call this thing again? Jack. Yeah, jack. And then it's got the two tank propane. It looks like 220 pounds, and I think it's actually set up with two six volt AGM or lithium batteries. I have to look again. But it is uh, does have solar on it. does have solar. So All right, let's, let's take, take a, a look, look inside. inside. So, like we said, it's just 16 feet. Nice front door right here. Come on in. We will, uh, we'll start with the uh, dinette right here. So as you can see, they've got the stuff here, but it's got a nice little dinette sitting area right here. And it's got some uh, storage up here. It looks like it's got a some kind of Sony player up here, Chris. And then you've got over here, you've got some more storage over here. And it's got the nice panoramic windows right there. If you come over here to the little kitchen area, it's got some more storage up here. A little stove top. It's got the two, two stove top propane burner. It's got a, probably like a, I don't know, two and a half yeah, cubic. Two cubic foot, two and a half, something like that. Yeah. It's got a little, uh, little microwave. A little cutie patootie. It's got a lot of uh, storage. Looks like it's got a real nice um, silverware here. And you got the sink. And then over here, um, if you come on over here, it's got some nice storage going on in here. Sure how well they can see with the light. Right? Yeah. Then up here you've got more storage. You got the panoramic windows. Bed is really super nice. It can fit two people real comfy here. And uh go ahead and swing that TV out. There's a TV here, which their invention was really good. I'm not sure I know how to do it. I'm there, not sure. There's a little cord underneath you pull. Oh, okay. Alright, there, there we go. go. And then if you pull this out like this. You can now, actually watch it. Yep, you can sit at the dinette and actually watch TV. Yep, or you watch in bed. You want to watch it in bed. Amazing, right? Right? And again, this is 16 feet. Then in here, you've got the bathroom, which is real nice. Small, but you know. So, no sink. Yep. Just a kind of a wet bath. Yep. And uh, as you can tell, the quality, real good quality in this. Nice. So here it looks like we have the uh, water heater control. It does have the sea level and uh, the Victron Energy yep. um, for solar. It's got some nice vents going on up here. It's Dometic, uh, Dometic AC, Penguin, ducted. Yep. So. Uh, but as you can see, if you, Chris, if you step out and kind of give them a panoramic from the yeah. door, it's it's small, but it serves its purpose for like you know short time travel. It's just what we're looking for. And you know, this is really super nice. Nice seating right here. It does have storage under there. It does have storage under here. It's a little tight. It's a little tight. But uh, I don't think I can open it. It'll pull. There it goes. Got some storage down there. So we're trying to work it in where they can. Yeah. So overall, 16 feet. Super cute. We're going to get pricing on it and uh, we'll provide all that with the video. Let's so go let's go see the other one. one. Alright, guys. So now we're at the Bambi. She's 20, as you can tell. Pan out, you can see she's a little bit bigger compared to sitting next to the Caravel. Uh, she doesn't have the back bumper area like the Caravel does. 
Yes. Yeah. Backup camera. Put the backup camera. It's got a little bit of storage back there. And if you come around here, it's probably got the same basic features as the Caravel. Uh, this would be the uh, on demand right there. Yep. Right? Yep. This Spinny, one is, black tank. No awning on this side. No awning on this side. Uh, same features in the front with the uh, batteries, the propane. This one does not have, as you can tell, this one does not have electric. And then uh, let's go on inside. This one obviously is bigger. So uh, this one's set up a little different, guys. You've got the bed up here in the front. And as you can see, a little bit different uh, cabinets here. And uh, beds in the front. Back is the kitchen. And then you've got the nice dinette right here. And as you come in, Chris, you can show them all that ample storage right there. So again, this is 20 foot. So we get about four feet more. The layout's different. I'm kind of unsure. I'm kind of digging the other layout, but... Just, you know, you get a little... You know, you just get that extra storage done. This is kind of neat because the, the galley and everything is yeah. all the way in the back. So, you got the sink. You've got your uh, two burner right here, stove top. You've got your microwave down here. Ooh, that's neat -o. Got a nice so, little spice rack. Spice rack, like I said. Yeah. A little more storage, a little more prep space. Up here, you got storage. Same, it looks like... You got your fridge right here. You got your little freezer right up there. And uh, then you've got in here, you've got a bigger bathroom. So this one has its actual, you know, kind of a sink toilet setup that you'd normally see in an RV. And I believe, oh, the door's locked. It has a little shower curtain nice. that goes across. So as you can tell, you got a 16 and you got a 20. Both these units are sold, so what we're being told is it's a deposit to uh, build, because they're building them from the factory. So we're kind of leaning towards this, kind of giving us y'all feedback, what you think of either one. We'd really like to hear back from everybody. Talk to y'all later.